Tip number two is going to be double or triple your jab. Now this is really, really important. So let's come over here. Now, this is important because if he gets into a pattern of only throwing a single jab, even if he's throwing it good, there still is a possibility that when he throws his jab, I time out, throw your jab, I somehow time my right hand at the same time, even if he's throwing it with conviction and I catch him over the top. It might not happen often, but there's still a chance. But now, what is he gonna do to prevent that? He's gonna double and triple his jab. Double your jab, come around, okay, do it again, double again.